Country, Clear 99. She looks like a Barbie, Kelsey Ballerini. Yes, she does. <laughs> if you go down, I'm going down too with Liz and Scotty in the morning. It's a, a story about how do kids really play with Barbie dolls. And I love the opening line of the story. It says, the earliest Mattel ads recommended that kids look up to their Barbie dolls. So why do so many kids torture them? <laughs> and that's the question today in honor of the Barbie movie coming out. What... Uh, what was the worst thing you ever did to your to your Barbie? And we have we've introduced GI Joe to the conversation as well. And if you would like to leave a comment on the Liz and Scotty Facebook page, or you can call or text 800 455 5257 Jason left us this great story. He said, My GI Joes would always stage a raid attack on the Barbie Dream House and all occupants inside. <laughs> My sister would always get so mad at me and have to redo her setup. This Barbie movie is probably going to bring back some painful memories for Jen. That's fantastic. Right? What was his name? Jason. Jason, thank you so much. Good morning. Good morning. This is Brenda, and you want to talk about Barbies and all that good stuff, right? Yes. So, my brother would have considered the worst thing that ever happened to his G.I. Joe was when my sister and I would borrow him because we couldn't have a Ken doll. So we used his G.I. Joe as Ken. And he hated it. He did. Um, G.I. Joe was this masculine, tough guy. And how dare we use him to be Barbie's boyfriend. Ken was a doll. G.I. Joe was an action figure. <laughs> exactly. Of course, you know, that just made my guy look better than everybody else's Ken doll, right? <laughs> uh, so that was the worst thing that we could have done to my brother's G.I. Joe.